Hello and welcome to another exclusive episode of our channel, this time, we are discussing a heartbreaking news, the host TJ Holmes' wife Marilee Feebig blindsided by alleged Amy Roback GMA affair. Watch this report, share with your friends, and we're coming with a lot more to share in this video. TJ Holmes' wife was blindsided by his alleged affair with his GMA3 co-anchor Amy Roback, an insider tells Page Six exclusively. The staffer tell us Holmes and his wife, Marilee Feebig, had been separated for several months but were trying to work things out when news of his romance with Roback broke Wednesday. She's devastated, she had no idea, our source says. They haven't been together in a while, but they were trying to work it out. They were just together for TJ's birthday, which is August 19th. The source notes that while Feebig hasn't been wearing her wedding ring, the now estranged couple were attempting to reconcile. Reps for Holmes and Feebig didn't return page 6 of requests for comment. Now before moving forward, please subscribe our channel and hit bell icon so we'll notify you whenever we blast breaking news here on YouTube. As Page Six reported, Holmes and Roback allegedly have been romantically intertwined since March despite their respective marriages to Feebig and Andrew Shu. However, sources told us this week that Roback and the Melrose Place alum's divorce is nearly finalized. He moved out earlier this summer, one source shared. They've constantly had problems over the years, and they finally broke up. Roback and Shu tied the knot in 2010, two years after her divorce from Tim McIntosh, the father of her two teenage daughters. Holmes and Feebig also wed in 2010. Holmes shares daughter Sabine with Feebig, who's an immigration lawyer. He also has two other children, Brianna and Jaden, with his ex-wife, Amy Furson. Eyewitnesses spotted the broadcasters, canoodling, in bars near ABC News Midtown Manhattan headquarters in May. Then, weeks before Thanksgiving, Holmes and Roback went on a getaway to a cabin in upstate New York, where he was seen grabbing her butt. They're not ashamed, they're two consenting adults who ended up loving each other, one ABC source told Page Six. It's not how they wanted news of their relationship, to come out, but it's also kind of a relief," the source added of cozy photos published by the Daily Mail. The pair arrived at ABC Studios together Thursday and taped GMA3 without mentioning the scandal. An ABC staffer later confirmed to Page Six that there will be no disciplinary action taken against the co-anchors. All they care about is the ratings, our source shared. This is ratings gold, that's why ABC News President Kim Goodwin wanted them on the show today. 